people welcome back to my channel Samantha Pollack today I'm gonna show you this makeup look every time I wear makeup in my hair tutorials you guys seems to like it and asking me if I want to do a makeup tutorial so today I'm gonna show you this golden bronze sun-kissed makeup look this is my favorite makeup look I am NOT a professional I'm not claiming to be a makeup artist this is actually the only eye makeup I can achieve without looking like a raccoon okay so if you're interested in this makeup look, keep on watching and don't forget to thumbs up this video and let me know in the comments what kind of videos you want to see from me. First I'm gonna prime my face with the NYX Shine Killer. Then I'm gonna use my favorite foundation by L'Oreal in the color W8. I work this in with a flat brush. I'm gonna do a tiny bit of color correcting, especially with this color corrector. This is the LA Girl Pro Concealer in color orange. This color is so intense, so I'm gonna use my fingers for this. I apply foundation where I added the color corrector. This is how I prefer to do my color correcting. Now I'm gonna use my beauty blender and blend the foundation into the skin. I use the LA Girl Pro Concealer and Creamy Beige. And I use my fingers to tap that all in. Now I use a small amount of foundation and I do this to make sure that the harsh lines are blended. I apply the creamy concealer on my nose and also on my cupid's bow. To set my face, I use the L'Oreal True Match Powder in the color W7. And I don't use the powder on the highlighted areas. To set my under eyes, I use the Benai Banana Powder. This is not from the drugstore, but I couldn't find anything else. The remaining product on the sponge, I'm gonna use on my chin and my T-zone. So to get this warm bronze look, I use my Rimmel Bronzer in Sun Dance. I use the same bronzer on my nose, I use a foundation brush to make the nose more defined. Now I dust the banana powder off with a fan brush. And I use a little bit of the banana powder to clean up the contouring. You want to blend this well, you don't want to have those harsh lines on your face. Now for my eyebrows, I use the MUA Brow Kit and all the product details will be in the description box down below. So make sure you check out the description box. To clean up my brows, I use the LA Girl Pro Concealer in Medium Beige. This is a little bit darker than the one I use on my face. So for the top part of the brow, I use my foundation to clean and make it more defined. I use an eyeshadow base by NYX to prime the eyelids. I use the makeup palette a New Day by Sleek. I use the color Let It Go as a transition color. I apply the color Be Happy to the lid and then I go in with silver lining and blend this out. I apply bright side to the lid and I know it's a little bit dark, you can't see the actual color but you will see it in a few seconds. I also apply this on my tear duct area. Under my lower lashes I applied the color Happy which you cannot see in this frame because my eyes were off screen. Filming a makeup tutorial is a hell of a job. <laughs> I use the NYX Nude Eyeliner in number 2. Now I apply lashes. This is from a store in Holland. It's called Hema. So to glow like the stars in the sky and the sun above earth. <laughs> I'm gonna use my sleek highlighting palette. I use a lip liner from Hema in the color 17 and then I use the NYX soft matte lip cream in the color Abu Dhabi I go back and forward with the lip liner and the lip cream so this is lip color number one 
So for the second color, I use Ping Pong Matte Finish by Bourjois. I love this bright pink color. This is my favorite spring summer lipstick. So now that everything is done, I use my Matte Finish Setting Spray by NYX. Let me know in the comments down below which one is your favorite, nude or pink. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, share and if you're new, make sure to subscribe. That way you won't miss another update from me. Bye! This hair is too much. Okay. My leg is hurting me